way to go today, don't we? Um, first of all, uh, credentials met um, about a week and a half ago via conference call. Um, we sat 15 new state committee members. These were a combination of a couple new counties that weren't certified and some, some vacancies that were filled. Um, so that, that went all smoothly. Um, unfortunately, Coweta County, which had a resignation, uh, asked to have the members sat, but um, they did not give proper notice for the meeting, so we were unfortunately not able to see um, that one member. Um, this morning, credentials met again. Um, several new state committees were, uh, members were sat. One was, a, again, a vacancy that was filled, and two more were uh, new, new parties. So we keep growing the state committee. Um, now this is an important reminder to all of you. If you are a state, especially if you are a county elected state committee member, basically your term ends today. Every county must next month elect new state committee members. That is in the bylaws. You can do it whether either at your normal monthly meeting or you can call a special meeting. But every county must have state committee elections next month. Anybody that's been that's been elected to um, over the last year or two, that your term still ends. So the people we sat today, they are just filling vacancies. Basically, they were they were sat to essentially vote today. Um, so when you have your elections, tell your chair or your secretary, please, 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 send in the appropriate paperwork. That is the signed affidavits that we all sign. If you need copies, I'll be happy to send them to you. And the most important thing, a copy of the meeting minutes of the election. And please make sure those minutes reflect who was elected. You'd be amazed. <laughs> please send those and I implore you, send them to about 10 different people. <laughs> No, I, I, I say this in jest, but I really mean it seriously, especially because there's going to be some turnover in officers and staff. Stuff gets lost. It happens. Most of us are volunteers. Send it to Rebecca, if she is still with us. Send it to Christian. Or send it to Justin. Send it to your congressional district chair. Send it to the, the vice chair for county parties. Send it to your new credentials chair. Send it to the new county affairs chair. If you're gonna send it to 10 different people, at least somebody's gonna get it. Um, so if anybody has any questions as to what to send, who to send it to, how to conduct your elections, please let me know, I'll be happy to help. Um, and so until we have a new credentials chair appointed, I'm happy to, to, to advise. Um, as this is my last meeting as credential chair, I want to thank the credentials committee for all their hard work. <laughs> Especially the, the incoming credentials committee because the first year, it's a tough year as you try to collect all that paperwork. <laughs> it really isn't a fun process. So please work with them, make, it, make their job easier. Um, I want to thank the Congressional District Chairs. I want to thank Arnold. I want to thank Sarah for all their work, help working with me, getting what we need so we can get as big a state committee as we have, making sure that this process goes as smoothly as I think it has over the last few years. Again, I want to thank everybody for their support. And let's have a great rest of the meeting. Thanks, y'all.